This experiment is to explain how fossils are made in layers of earth and rocks. Okay, to do this experiment, you need gummies. I have worms, fish, bears, llamas, and octopus. You also need different types of bread. So here I have white bread and wheat bread to represent different layers of rocks. So I layered them white, wheat, white, wheat. So the gummies represent the animal remains and the different pieces of bread represent the different layers of rock. And to finish the process, you're also gonna need a textbook or something heavy and another paper plate. So first you put one slice of bread on the plate. Then you're gonna take your animal remains, which are the gummies, and you're gonna lay a few on the bread. Should we really get them in there? Okay, and then you're gonna take another piece of the bread and you're gonna put it right on top, push it down a little bit, and you're gonna repeat the process. And you're gonna do the same thing with another piece. And you're just gonna keep layering. And you're gonna put your last piece on. And you're gonna cover the layers of rock and animal remains with your plate, push it down, and put your heavy object right on top. So after you wait a few minutes for your fossils to form, you're gonna take off your heavy object and your plate, and you're gonna carefully remove the layers one by one. So if you look here, you can somewhat see them forming in here, but when you pick up your gummies, you can see all the imprints of what you put in. There's the other side. Even though normally fossils are formed after animal or plants are on the ground and covered by sediment for years and years, they're affected by erosion and weathering, and this experiment gives you an idea of that. And as you look at the bread, you can see the impressions.